be anything left of your home village. All of your people are dead. Oh my god! That man must be the protagonist! He just killed a guy out of frustration. Wow. Nice guy. Well, guys, it's time for the deadliest enemy we've ever fought. The Assassin Cock! Yes! Yeah. Oops! Get us to the monster. I won't let you humiliate us anymore. Hell oh my god, look at the Helena Warden's name! I am Helena Warden he three There you go, guys. There you go. We're now an anime streamer. Turned to the village. For some reason. He ran into the flight. The thought of living with me and my mother was so terrifying for him, he would rather burn to death. I mean, I'm not the French king. And my mother followed my father to the village because the thought of living with me alone was too terrible to bear. So she ran to burn to death. I was left alone, shivering, waiting for dawn, while my parents would rather die screaming in agony. <laughs> the sun revealed a foreign landscape. That was alright. In fact, it, can I just say something? And this sounds like an insult, and it kind of is. That fight was more engaging than almost every boss fight in Tor, not counting Directive 7. I think a game wasting your time might actually be the worst thing a game can do. I mean, there's bad gameplay, there's boring gameplay, but then pure, unmitigated grind, pure padding, at a literal philosophical level, bothers me because of how finite time is in general, but also in specific. Like, we only have, you know, 100-ish years to us. And then there's the fact that I have to be so careful with my time because I have so little of it. Well, I don't feel like fighting this guy, so I'm out. Peace! Because I accidentally went the right way. What the hell is that? She's expecting us in her room. If you know what I mean. Sorry. A lot of, I, a lot of people tend to say nostalgia as if it's a negative thing. And I, I mean, I understand why. It's because assholes, let's say what it is, would, would use nostalgia as a defense. Well, you just don't understand how great this classic is without, you know, anything other than nostalgia to defend it. That's nostalgia blindness. That, that's separate. That, that's like a further extent, a more severe extent of just enjoying something because of nostalgia. Yeah, Mystic Quest is another good example of a game that I enjoy that is a bad game. Wow, he is straight up lying about the stone. That's hysterical. And Rose is gonna kill him. I'm just saying, you want to see what a real-life adventure would look like? Indiana Jones. Can you do that in the next boss fight, Ashel, please?
Oh, you son of a submariner. Right. That's gonna suck. Because I'm pretty sure his defense is lowered up here, too. Yep, that sucked. <laughs> that was the suckitude. Up, oh, up. Oh. Instant kill! Die instantly! Nom, 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 fling. Why is it called can't combat? I mean, I guess that, that that is accurate. He can no longer combat. That is a truthful. This is it. My final opportunity to not suck. And I failed at it. Nope. Oh, okay, it's dead. Oh, thank God. Okay, okay. Let's see how high we can get her speed, shall we? 110! <laughs> you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> Kill me and go to Velweb. I dedicate my death to your departure. <laughs> okay. That actually might get a plus by itself. Wow. That was great. Kill me and move on. Okay, and then he drops the sword as he's lunging. Bam! Just right in the face. Oh, God. I'm just gonna shot down.